I'm Marty Lynn. I'm the principal engineer of robotics here at General Motors. I'd like to introduce you to my colleague Chris Erke and also to R2. R2 is the uh, humanoid robot that was developed as a collaboration between General Motors and the NASA Johnson Space Center. And uh, what we'd like to show you today is something that we call the Human Grasp Assist or Robo Glove. And this was really inspired by the, the work that was done on the hands of R2. The unique thing about R2 is its hands and its abilities to manipulate objects and to do work. We've taken the same sort of technology, the tendon-driven um, uh, actuators and the sensors, and translated that from the robot into a glove that the human operator could wear. This glove provides uh, additional grip force on the order of 10 pounds to be able to help the operator do their job longer and better. Chris is wearing a prototype uh, that was done in cooperation with NASA and it's really a self-contained unit. It has all of the drive electronics, the microprocessor, the motors, and the tendon-driven uh, actuation system that uh, really can help uh, a, a human worker grasp objects like a drill motor or uh, any other type of object that you would use while doing really real work and really uh, reduce the fatigue and the overall ergonomic stressors that the workers feel when doing their day-to-day -day operations. Well, the glove itself is actually quite comfortable. Uh, it weighs about two pounds um, in the forearm and the glove itself, not including the battery weight, which would be worn separately. The device itself is, of course, safe for humans. 